Captain Bay's passion for chance attained such vast proportions that she came up with an extraordinary way of navigation she proudly named the Random Compass. My dear crew, I have invented a new way to choose a random course for the ship. Each morning we will twist that non-magnetic compass needle twice in a row and then we'll take the arithmetic mean of the cardinal directions on the dial as the ship's new destination. Let us illustrate this idea with some examples. If the needle stops at south on the first turn and west on the second, the average yields southwest. But if the needle holds at east first and then points in the opposite direction west, the two directions cancel each other out and thus the crew gets a day off. <laughs> oh, I am so enthusiastic about this idea. I shall be delighted to learn what you think about this. Please share your thoughts with me. The crew, however, the sailing master Pascal, the navigator Bernoulli and the quartermaster Laplace were highly critical about this exotic way of navigation. As our sailing master, I wonder whether all directions have the same chance. Moreover, I would like to know how many days do we have to work now? That random compass is an interesting device, order. I do not wish to provoke you, Pascal. But rarely enough is the wind on our sailing master's side. Don't you remember the day we headed for Poisson Island, where we ran aground on the shallow tail of the island, since she simply couldn't stay the course? What do you think might be the odds Pascal is sailing the desired direction? As your quartermaster, I have to ask the most important question. What are we going to have for dinner today? I can't stand having another ratio of potatoes. We've had them for five days. It's time for a juicy roast, if you ask me. Oh, now I'm sure why I won't sail without you. These are quite challenging questions, opening up three different perspectives. I like that. Let me think about them. Can you assist Captain Bass with the answering of all these questions? What are the chances to choose the direction northwest? How many days will the crew have to work each week on average? What are the odds that Pascal manages to sail into the chosen direction? Will there be roast for dinner? In the next video, you will learn how to classify these questions and you will already find answers to some of them.